so today we are talking about um, the new teas at David's Tea. Um, they actually released them today, Tuesday the uh, second. Um, they're iced tea teas, and they're kind of doing it a little different. Normally, they release the iced teas um, with like summer type teaware. They only released teas today. And I did get samples of the new release teas. So there's there's a couple of them that are um, re-promotes that we've seen previously. Um, that includes the guava. Um, oh, I, the name escapes me now. There's a green tea one that's a re-promote. The mango fruit punch and the tropicalia. That is also a re-promote. Um, but a new tea, they have um, two new teas. And the one we're going to talk about today is called Flamingo Fresca. This is a white tea. Generally, I do all of my teas as hot. However, because these are explicitly being marketed for iced tea, I did them as iced teas. Um, so this is a white tea, and it says um, Strawberry Passion Pop. Um, ingredients are apple, pineapple, white tea, sprinkles, uh, let's see here, orange peel, lemongrass, strawberry, passion fruit, marigold blossoms. There's just a lot of different sub ingredients in this. But I had two samples, so I made two of them for this review, and I put it into my David's Tea, tea Press. And it smells wonderful. Now I do have, I did take a photo of the tea. It is a beautiful tea. Um, you have those flamingo pink sprinkles, which is so cute. And I am a sucker for anything with sprinkles in it. Uh, and then you can see the fruit, you can see the white tea, and you can see um, the lemongrass in there. So I'm gonna insert a picture now of what that tea looks like. So that's what the tea looks like. Um, really pretty, pretty tea there. Um, so I steeped it up. It says 195 degrees. I think I actually steeped it a little less than that. I did it at a white tea temperature. And it says three to five minutes. I did do it for five minutes. There really wasn't an abundance of white tea in the blend. So that's why I felt like um, a longer steep time. It, it may benefit from a longer steep time. So I have it, again, it says an iced tea in here. My tea press. I always like to kind of give it a minute once I press it down to have like the hot tea come to temperature with the ice. I think it just, I don't know, tastes better that way. Okay. I like this one. I like it. Um, I used two samples, so I feel like that gave me a pretty good, I think each, um, each sample bag is about a perfect spoon of tea, and so with two of them, that's two perfect spoons, and that's normally what I would put into my iced tea press. It's got a really nice strawberry fruity flavor. First thing I taste is kind of like that passion fruit. And you know how passion fruit can sometimes have almost a, um, not quite bitter, but it has a very distinct flavor. It always kind of like a, a grapefruit, that kind of not quite bitter, but there's a, and so I don't want to say bitter. It's not bitter like that, but I, I can just taste the, the, the passion fruit. Um, it's not bitter, but it kind of has, I don't know, like drying effect. It, it just has a, a distinct kind of taste on the tongue. The grapefruit, the backside of that is strawberry. There's a little bit of tartness. I can taste a little bit of that lemongrass. I actually really like this one. Um, I feel like it's pretty well developed because I'm getting the strawberry. I'm getting a passion fruit flavor. I'm tasting that lemongrass. I wouldn't add sweetener to this. I feel like it's really got a nice natural sweetness to it, probably from that apple that's been added. This is really nice. I really like this one. I feel like, um, like last year, my favorite 
Ice tea was the, um, oh gosh, now I forget the name of it. Um, it was like an orange, bitter, bitter orange type tea. Um, I'll have to look when I get done filming. I'll remember it when I go look at it. Um, apparel, something spritz is apparel spritz. I think that was the name of it. Um, and I stocked up on that one. I could see stocking up on this one because I do, I really like it. I, I like it a lot. Yeah, sweet strawberry. The white tea really doesn't come out at all. I didn't expect it would with such a little white tea in the blend. And that's why I think five minutes is a pretty good time for this. And um, that nice passion fruit. I really like it. Yeah. So that's my look at Flamingo Fresca. Um, if you have any questions, leave those below. Or if you've tried it, leave a comment below. And thanks so much for watching. Bye.